All right, so. Alrighty here. We got Shadow versus Snooters. Shadow, um, player that mains, or like plays a lot of characters. And Snooters, a traditional Ganon main. So, Snooters had a really good performance in doubles at the last Arcadian, which was held um, a few days ago. Yeah, it's not, not too long ago now. And uh, he put up a really good showing in double, so we'll see how he uh, goes into this. Anyways, getting started on Smashville. They are three stocks, I should probably let that go. <sighs> Alright, so they were three stocks, so they're just gonna quickly restart that. All right, so okay, so that should be better now. Anyways, um, it looked about even when we left off, but um, you gotta say Ganon probably traditionally wins this matchup. Sorry, Ganon, not Ganon. Falcon traditionally wins this matchup because it's faster, pretty darn strong, has a much better combo game, grab good, good grab game, better recovery. He, he's just overall kind of a better character, but you know Ganon. He makes up for what he lacks in raw power. Like, he can just kill you, like, super quick. But anyways, getting right into it. Back on Smashville. Um, Snooter's racking up a quick percent here on Shadow. Using those tilts and aerials very effectively to bring on this percent. Oh, and Shadow with a nice conversion there. Back there to F Smash on, a miss, on the missed tech. Going for a charged F Smash. A little bit of question we'll read there, but, um, you know, he's going for it. Snooter is using the um, actual hitbox as opposed to the grab of Ganon's up here to get that uh, damage on up here. And he runs right into the charged Ganon F smash. Or sorry, up smash. With the uh, Raptor boost. Good catch by Snooter's there. Okay, so what I want to see Shadow do is try to get Snooter's off stage. Just try to like edge guard him a little bit, but then again, at the same time, that is kind of scary against a Ganon that's up a stock, because a Ganon can just end you off stage with his side beat. So you really have to respect that. But, uh, so far, Snooter's doing a good job putting on this damage. Oh, scary move there, and the F-Smash should take that. Yep, 61% deficit, not too bad. Chad is definitely still in this. Let's see how he adapts to this, um, Ganon play coming out by Snooter's, though. And, uh, a little bit of a high side beat. They're running into the up smash. Snooter's using that up smash very well, understanding that it is very low end lag and you can use pretty much anything after that. Very good pressure. Probably Ganon's best smash attack. Using that down B to cover the stage. Lots of down B's coming out, and the forwarder will take it across the stage. Game one, going to Snooter's. Alrighty, so we'll see where we go next. Um. I feel like Snooters might ban Lilat. And if not, you know, it's just an educated guess. I I'm pretty sure Ganon doesn't like Lilat. Not many people like Lilat. It's a stage that kind of messes up characters, but you know, everyone kind of has their like character specific jank on Lilat, so I know Ganon can do something. Uh, you'd have to ask Snooters about it, but. We're gonna see a character switch coming in from Shadow here, you know? Let me switch into the cloud. Classic pocket cloud coming through. And we're going back to Smash. So, I would have uh, maybe thought that Battlefield, Dreamland, or another platform stage like Town and City might be better for uh, Cloud here because with the moving platform, it's a lot harder to pressure Ganon on the platforms. I mean, granted, it's still Cloud, and Cloud definitely wins this matchup, but um, Snoop is putting up a good showing so far. Already 82% on Shadow, 95. He's just racking up this percent very quickly. Um, we need to see Shadow do some more uh, safe aerials like Nair and... Uh, oh, and he will get the spike. Very good stuff by Shadow there. Good recognition, knowing that Ganon will not be able to recover that and throwing out the forward air. Alright, so Snooters, we're going to take this stock back. Um, down B, closing a lot of distance out. Here comes an edge to Oh, <laughs> went for the up tilt. Not quite gonna connect, so it was a good try, though. You don't see... That's pretty much the only opportunity to ever use it. Oh, 
Anyways, he has him off stage. Good, good stuff charging limit there. Gets his limit. 140% almost max rage cloud. If he can build Ganon up to maybe 70-ish percent, limit crosslock will quite start killing. But then um, he used uh, limit blade beam there, burning his limit, which is uh, kind of a poor decision there because it might have uh, saved his life and it might have allowed him to recover in a situation he might have needed it. But, you know, things happen. So, I'm gonna see... Um, Oh, Sooner's already almost even percent. He accidentally forward airs and SDs. Uh, unfortunate. They don't like to see that, but uh, he, he played a lot better in that game than the previous game. So, good stuff to both players. Congratulations to Sooner's for winning, and we'll uh, be moving on to the next game.